Hey everybody, Keith K here with a quick Stranded Deep update. There have been some changes to the um, menu and the crafting menu, and I thought I would just cover those real quick um, in case you're watching some of my other video tutorials and you don't see the same menus that I see. So the first thing that's changed is just the um, equip menu. So you hit tab, and now you get this wheel. Um, and so there's now there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten slots. That's the maximum. And actually, you can only pit, put nine things in because one is your empty hand. So it's pretty straightforward. You just press and hold the tab key. You do have to hold the tab key. And then you rotate this with your mouse. And whatever you're pointing to when you release the tab key is what you have. So that's the first change. Uh, the interaction with the item once you have it is the same. You know, the left mouse button is still the uh, action button in that case. Um, so that's pretty straightforward. And then let's take a quick look at the crafting menu, which has changed quite a bit. Instead of uh, the kind of window that came up in the beginning when you press C, you get a crafting menu on the right-hand side here, and you can scroll through to see what you can build. Uh, and it is divided up into furniture, structures, and then tools. Um, so for example, let's see, I need a crude axe. Uh, it says I'm missing, so I've got one, uh, one lashing, I've got one stick, and I'm missing uh, one stone tool to be able to make that. So I would go up, make a stone tool, and now uh, it's, the same, it's the same interaction as before, right? So you, you hit the C to open the crafting menu. You select with the mouse what you want to craft, and then you position it, and again, left mouse will create and drop it on the ground. Um, so we can now go ahead and build the crude axe and the same thing happens, right? You select it, figure out where you want it, and then you drop it on the ground. Okay, so th uh, that's really about it. Now we can pick that up. There are uh, some changes to the actual uh, menu items. You'll see that incorporate this new structure called the tanning rack um, down here. We have a loom and also a tanning rack that we have to be able to build. So, uh, and that will allow you to do things like create uh, leather, which is now required for the refined axe, right? So the refined axe now requires leather, an extra stone tool, and a crude axe. Whereas I believe it used to be um, some lashings. Now we need leather. So you can look for another tutorial on uh, the loom and the leather, uh, but this covers the changes to the crafting menu here. All right, see you back here soon. And remember, if you like this video and you want to see more, please like and subscribe or leave me a comment down below. I do read them all. All right, take care.